All right, good morning. It's a rainy Wednesday. We got the whole family in here. No. Yeah, Abigail just left her out, right? She's the only one early today. Emily and Mommy are taking me to uh, pick up my car because um, hopefully the wheel's fixed and then uh, these guys are coming back here to go to school. No, then I have to go to my 11 year old checkup. 11 years old. I've been able to do it for over a month now. Really? Well, a little under a month, actually. Wow. Does it feel any different than being 10? <laughs> That's for sure. No. Mm -mm. Except you're really tall. You gotta ask him that question. How tall are you gonna be when you grow up? When you finish growing? What's his estimate? Okay? I really don't wanna be six feet tall. You're not gonna be. I love to hear what he says because uh, I never got that done when I was a kid. At least I didn't I didn't know if I did. All right, waiting for mom to come back out so we can drive off. <laughs> All right, so the girls just dropped me off. I'm walking over to get my car at Discount Tire, which is up the street here. This is uh, South Boulevard. And uh, the 45 train station's up there too. So that's right where the Discount Tire is. Okay, here we are at the train station where I used to commute from and now there's Discount Tire. I walked all the way from way down there, down the side road and then across. All right, we're back in business. Four tires, good to go. We're at the doctor. So here we are. We're at Emily's 11 year old checkup. We made it with a few minutes to spare. It was a stressful morning once again. But you ready? No. You're not ready? What do you think is going to happen? Shot. Yeah, she probably has to have a shot. So we'll see. Two. Hopefully, Tom's picking up the car and we're good to go. And we have no other issues this week. Okay, so here we are waiting for the doctor. Emily was just weighed and got her height, and she five, is three. five three. Wow! So now we're just waiting for the rest of the checkup. All right, the car made it in one piece! Yay! I made it to work. The car ran well. The tire held up, so uh, I'm happy. Tina got nabbed. Oh, there's two cops. <laughs> just you know, just so you know, they can't see through here. So, <laughs> oh, the rye breads are up in the air. Oh, get her! Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? Does anybody want to tweet this to Bob? Look at them. They're all scared. What you gonna do when they come for you? When you were eight and you had bad treats, you got food. If you get hot, then you must get cool. Bad boys. I just passed him. Getting pulled over in the parking lot and working. Alright, boys, you think the second group unit can go? I heard what was Post doctor visit and two shots later, Emily gets a treat for breakfast. Where are we? Salsa and water bagel. Mommy's got a treat too. Yum yum. yum. All right, there went the speeder. She just went by um, up on the top road over there. She just told me, yeah, she got nabbed for speeding, which was a surprise. I did, I did see the cop that she passed and flew by on the way to work this morning. Luckily, I didn't get pulled over because I was doing the speed limit. I'm a safe driver. I drive really good on the driveway, like Rain Man. Anyway, she, yeah, she said the reason why she had backup is because uh, she came down the side road basically to uh, make sure the cop was safe and you know she didn't want she didn't want him to get out because this road back here is narrow. So if she pulled over. Um, the curb is high. She couldn't have gone over the curb. That's for sure. So she just wanted to bring the cop to a safe place. 
Um, the cop probably thought she was trying to run because there is a there is a loop around thing down here. So anyway, it would have been fun to see you know police chased out here at work. Anyway, heading to get my hair cut. Finally, this thing's a mess. Can't wait to do that. So headed down back towards home and um, haircut time for me. So here we are at the end of the day. We have totally switched it up for this Wednesday. We are now at Chick or now sorry, we are not at Chick-fil-A. We are at TCBY for dessert. Agatha is way over there. She does not want to sit with Emily and I don't really know why. How's Bob? Emily's here. We had McDonald's for that one for dinner. And Emily and I had five guys, and we're bringing some home for Tom, I think. And uh, we've still got a big night ahead of us. we got a haircut for Tom, and we've got uh, dance for me. to get ready. Yeah, Emily still has another dance class. And we have picture day tomorrow, so we've got to get ready for picture day at school. All I really want to do is put my head down on the table and go to sleep. But, how's it going? Oh, okay. And then the other one, haircut time. Finally, a good haircut. Nice long. Lots of hair on the floor. Scooper, scooper, scooper is here. So Emily and I are home from dance. I'm wondering what little, um, what little bear has been in my kitchen. Total mess. I know I didn't leave it like this. I don't know what's going on upstairs. Dance party maybe? We'll see. He's in his underwear, not just making. Oh, okay. Here it is, the after. My hair color. I look good, don't I? Yeah, yeah. I was supposed to get this done this weekend, but um, I missed my appointment because I don't remember why. Anyway, um, girls just got home. We're going to bed. Wednesday's over. We'll see you on Thursday. Be the best human being you could be. And see you tomorrow on Thursday.